Keir Starmer's recent proposal to cut the winter fuel allowances for millions of pensioners has been passed by the House of Commons. A total of 348 MPs voted in favor of Starmer's proposal, while 228 MPs voted against it. Despite their opposition, they were unable to prevent Starmer from implementing this controversial policy. According to reports, MPs from Reform UK, the Liberal Democrats, the SNP, the Green Party, and the Conservatives voted against Starmer's plan. Now that efforts to block the proposal have failed, Labour MP Lee Anderson has vowed to name and shame all Labour MPs who supported Starmer's decision. Anderson stated, Next year we have the county elections in Nottinghamshire, and I can tell you now, this will be on every single leaflet. I will name and shame every Labour MP in Nottinghamshire who voted for this pernicious, cruel act of Parliament. Similarly, the Conservative Party is also planning to put pressure on Labour MPs who supported Starmer. For context, many Labour MPs had previously promised to vote against Starmer's plan. However, only one Labour MP, John Trickett, followed through and voted against it while others abstained. With Labour accused of betraying the trust of pensioners, other political parties are now strategizing to make them pay for their actions. Do you think Labour MPs should be named and shamed? Comment with your thoughts 